Mm, hello guys, it's it, it's your girl here, W Vanilla, and my last video was a five subscriber special. I'm really grateful for that, even though it might not seem like much to you. It's it's a lot to me, cause I've never really gotten this far on channels. But anyways, uh, now I have now six subscribers, and we're almost very close to our next goal. Now, basically, we're probably just going to be playing some Roblox games, you know, I'll we'll probably just be talking about random stuff in the games, you know, yeah. Also, uh, yes, I know it's four in the morning, but who cares? Mm, I get up early. I'm an early bird. I get up early no matter what. Even if it's not a school day, it's not a school day! And also, I have like two weeks of school left. So that means in the summer I might upload more, but uh, I don't really want anyone to find out about my channel yet. I've told my brother about it, but he says it's probably cringe, <laughs> which right now, it, mm, mm, for me it isn't, but I used to do little LPS videos or, you know, the videos of animal toys, but now I'm not going to do those anymore because those take me really long and... I tend to mess up on those more, so those videos you won't see anymore. <laughs> but anyways, I might upload a gotcha video because someone suggested it because they said it would be more entertaining. I've only uploaded one, but I might upload another one. Give me- in this video, comment if- if anyone watched this, by the way. <laughs> comment an idea for a gotcha life video. Because I want to make another one because someone wanted that, so yeah. Basically, if you suggest a genre of videos that I can do, then I'll do it. But anyways, we're going to be playing some Adopt Me. And maybe some other games. And also, just quick notice, my phone kind of glitches. Where basically, if I leave Roblox... It takes, like, at least a minute to load the screen again to look like this, like it did, uh, does right now. So, basically, I have to close the app and then reopen it to make it work. Probably the only reason for that is because of probably, um, throwing my phone. Yeah, I feel like I have anger issues, so, uh, I've thrown things before. Yeah. Anyways, back to what we were gonna do. So, adopt me... If you don't know, Adopt Me got a new update for accessories. Now, the hat shop is now going to be called the accessory shop, which makes a lot more sense. And also, Adopt Me has accessory chests, which are super cool, by the way. Get them. They're really cool. So, basically, it's a chest with... It's a chest with new accessories. And also, sometimes Adopt Me glitches for me. Oh, it's loading. I saw the chat. If you see the chat thing while you're loading on the blue screen for Adopt Me. Also, I might turn the music off. Or at least turn it down. I at least gotta have something in this void. Turned it down to 45%. And, yes, I am working on a Neon Snow Owl. And also, if you're wondering where I got the um, gold horn from, I got it from trading yesterday. I traded my Snow Owl for a gold horn and ride otter. I know a lot of you are going to come comment on the video. Oh, that's not fair. Blah, blah, blah. Shut up. It's what I wanted to do. So, yeah. I'm sorry if I'm getting mad, it's just, in Adopt Me, if you want to do it, it's your decision. I know it's not fair, but I just wanted it. <laughs> oh yeah, if you're wondering how I made this rideable, I traded a ride follow deer for a ride potion. I know that's over, most likely, but I just wanted to make it rideable, okay? In Adopt Me, basically my opinion on trading is like, do a trade, and if you're happy with it, you're okay, you don't have to have people tell you, hey, that's unfair. So, if you're happy with it, you're happy. I'm happy with it, so... Don't tell me that it's unfair. <laughs> Sorry if I'm getting mad, like I said earlier, it's just, uh... 
I don't want you guys commenting like, oh, that's unfair, you shouldn't have done that. It's just if you're happy with the trade, do the trade. Like, it doesn't really matter. It's your account and your pets, so it's your responsibility for them. No, it's, like, not your responsibility for them, but it's your pets, so it's what you want to do with them. Oh. Here are the accessory chests that are new. I want this plant hat right here. This is the standard chest, and this is the regal chest. Yeah, that's what it's called. It has a higher chance for legendary, but we're gonna buy a standard one because we have enough money. That one's like, how much money? We could buy two standard chests. We have enough. We're gonna open both of them. And they're gifts and they're legendary. Oh, we got another one of the hats. We got another one of these hats. Hey, I like this hat though. It kind of reminds me of, like, some sort of, like, it kind of looks like pizza dough with, like, chocolate on it. It sounds really disgusting. Because <laughs> it probably actually is. Oh, I think we have one of these already, but that's okay. We're gonna get duplicates of a lot of them. There are also apparently animated accessories, and the two legendary ones I know of are this toaster hat and this sandwich hat. Which a lot of people really want right now for some reason. <laughs> but, um, I am making a Neon Snow Owl. I will make a video making that, but... That's in progress. <laughs> but basically, uh... Yeah. That's what I'm working on. And if you're wondering, oh, if you're making a Neon Snow Owl, are you going to make a Mega? Mm, the answer to that is no. Because making a Mega Snow Owl, I know that seems fun. That sounds fun, actually. It doesn't seem. But it would just take me too long to get 16 Snow Owls, which is the amount of pets you need to make a Mega. To do that, and it would be a lot of trading and convincing people. So basically, yeah. Or no, like, the people would be like, oh, you're under. So, basically, no. I would not make Mega Snow Owl. I just want to make Neon. Because the only reason I'm actually attempting this again was, um... I did it a while ago, but I ended up just giving up and trading them all away. Which, I'm not going to do that this time. I actually want to make it. And also, in my first vlog I did, which is attempting to make Fairy Bread... I'm sorry if I made it wrong, because, uh, I did not cut it into triangles, I cut it into squares, probably pissed a lot of Australians and New Zealand off, and also, uh, I didn't have the right sprinkles, so I had to use Christmas sprinkles, which were the only ones we had, and also, keep in mind, that was my first time making it, it's a top tier snack from what I made, at least. I want to try to make the actual version and get, like, the correct sprinkles and stuff. I might do that. It's just, uh, one, I don't want to ask for it, and two, uh, I might not do that. There might be a video in the near future, making fairy bread. Yeah. Um, I don't really know how to cook yet. I'm, I'm not out of school either. If you're asking what my age is, I ain't telling you. Basically, I'm not going to tell you my age because I feel like that information's more private, but yeah. Anyways, off of that. So you know how in Cooking Run Kingdom, I kept on saying that I needed help beating stage 1031? You know what I did one day at school? Or at one morning? No, it doesn't really matter, so I think... I finally beat it with six seconds left, and I'm so proud of myself. I finally beat it. I'm on episode 11 now. I went through a cutscene, but I'm not gonna tell you it, because that's spoilers, and that's not nice to spoil it. Even though I watched the whole entire episode 12 story. Yeah, I actually did on YouTube. I don't even know why I did. But I just did, because I was bored. And also, I think I have to go visit family members today, so that's why I'm uploading this video now. 
But, uh, sorry if I'm kind of just talking about personal topics for me. Mm, sorry if I kind of ramble in my videos, because I might do that. That's what I'm kind of doing in this video. This video doesn't really have a topic, it's just a random video. I might just upload videos like these if I don't have any ideas. They're basically just, like, fillers. So you guys actually have something to watch. Now, I'll at least upload every other day. So that means if I upload today, I won't upload till Monday. So in the summer, I might upload more. My brother knows I have a channel. It's just he doesn't really care. I don't really think anyone cares if I have a channel. It's just I'm doing it. I'm just saying, if any of you ask, oh, if you get so much popular, then will you ever, like, monetize your channel? If you don't know what that means, it basically means, like, you can start making money off of your channel. You can, like, put ads on your video. If anyone asks me that, I'm gonna say no. Let me just say, this is only for fun, really. I just wanna make videos for fun. I don't wanna make money or anything. I just wanna make these for fun, okay? These are for fun purposes. <laughs> also, I'm going to do a bunch of genres of things. Like like I said in one of my last videos, that on my channel, you don't know what you're getting each day. Like, one day I could upload Roblox, the next day I could upload a vlog or Cookie Run. Oh yeah, more Cookie Run videos might be to come. It's just Cookie Run Kingdom videos are kind of hard to make, considering that there's not a lot of things you can do after you unlock all the playable modes, which I did. Because after you clear stage 1031 in Cookie Run Kingdom, the new mode Cookie Alliance is unlocked. And I have that now, which gives me something else to do. And I can also get relics for the Guild Museum. So I'm training a ride potion. I don't really want off a horde. And also my trades, they're not off, they're just, they're still on. It's just I don't want to trade right now because, yeah. We're gonna go do the hot spring first because it's closer. We'll, we'll bathe slush later. Basically, uh, this snow's former name was Snowy. But I already had a snow named Snowy, so I, I was gonna get confused. So, uh, I just named it slush. <laughs> These are all my favorite pets, not flexing. Yes, yeah, so I'm trying to make a Mega Tiger, but I haven't done it yet. I can make a Neon Woodpecker. I need one. If anyone has a fox and or something like that, or um, really doesn't want their fox, I can. I'll give you a skeleton dog for a fox. Just really want to make a Neon one. If I eventually want to, but I'm gonna make a neon, okay? I might think about becoming a neon maker and adopt me. I'm trying to work on my neon snow owl. But basically, if you didn't get my last explanation, one of my other videos was I have this weird rule I've made over the years with my neons when I'm making them. So basically, the rule is kind of like. Basically, the pet that is the highest age or is the most aged up or basically, like, for example, uh, I have four, um, ginger cats. Let's just say that. This is an example. I don't actually have four ginger cats, but basically, let's say I have four ginger cats and one's a preteen, one's, no, like, one's teen, one's... Junior, one's preteen, and one's posty. Let's just say that for the scenario. I will start on the posteen one first. Because it is the highest aged up, and I can get done the most quickly and move on. And then basically it goes on like second most aged up. So on and so forth. But however though, if all the ginger cats were newborn, and none of them were aged up, I will just pick one and start. Yeah, that's how making a neon for me works. It's a weird thing I've established for myself, but yeah. Also, the Easter event ended, and I just found out the Sugar Glider was actually only temporary in-game. So that means I'm probably never gonna get one now, because they're gonna be super rare. I might get one eventually. 
Look, it's a Neon Phoenix! Look at that! It's so cool! I love Neon Phoenixes. They're so pretty. They're so pretty. Like, oh my gosh. But I've never been able to get access or get one from trading. Unfortunately, the Easter event did end. It was pretty cool. I bought a uh, Springer Spaniel before it ended in Carmel. I had one before previously, but uh, I traded it. And then I got one back. And the brown one was named Carmel. I got the brown one. I didn't, I didn't have time to get the black spaniel. I'm so sorry. I might trade for one. Slush, you're stuck! Oh. Not stuck anymore. Do you hate when you're stuck on something in a game and then, like, like minutes, days later, maybe you just, um... Um... You finish it finally. You know, in my fairy bread vlog, if you don't know, I have cats. I have two of them. Very good. And pets. Very good. Cats. They're very good. Most of the time. They can get in trouble sometimes, but overall, they're good. One of them is male. And the other one is female. The female one is younger than the one we've had for like two years now. So their names are Gizmo and Muffin. The Muffin is the female and Gizmo is the male. For some reason, the male Gizmo, he's really fat for some reason. The cat, not the person, it's a cat. And then Muffin's like a kitten still, basically. Yes. Yeah, that's basically all about my cats. I don't know the muffin's age, but I know Gizmo's like three years old now. I don't know what he is, but yeah. Ooh, is that only Ryan? Why are so many people sending me friend requests? I usually don't get friend requests as frequently, so... Okay. Oh, um, I'm I'm watching a video. I'm watching a video in the background, and so I might be paying more attention to that than this video. So I'm so sorry, because when I make YouTube videos, just quick uh thing I've probably talked about a gazillion times was, um, I wa I like to watch videos while I make them, because if I'm in like a soundless room. It kind of makes me scared a little bit, so, uh, I just get, uh, I just get uncomfortable in a room that doesn't have a lot of sound. For me, I don't like that. Especially at night. Like, at night, I'll usually have my TV on, playing a video, and music also. Yeah, I, I, I just sleep like that, okay? Don't judge me. And also, yeah. Ooh! I thought that was Mega Cerberus, but it's actually Mega Kangaroo. Mega Kangaroos are... Our pot is rare. Yeah, I know. And I have one! I'm not gonna do that, because I really like this. I didn't know this tiger... This version of the tiger was neon pink. I love it. It fits the tiger so well. You know the neon colors that switch on the lunar tiger and the golden one tiger is um is um basically you know how the neon a uh, golden tiger is blue but it doesn't match it should be changed to red because it looks so cool and then for the lunar tiger they should change the neon color. To like green or the, the color of the golden lunar tiger, the original. I know it's like a dot music decision, but it's just an idea. I think the golden lunar tiger neon would look really cool in red. 
Well, technically, you can make a Mega, and then you won't have to worry about just the blue anymore, but yeah. The neons basically make you the Megas. This is Luminous, so it's full neon age. It used to be an Adopt Me, where basically, um... If you got a neon, they would just be full grown instead of reborn. But technically, if they're a neon, four pets fused together, then you, you can't, like, yeah. But anyways, um, I might end the video soon. Even though it's not been that long. I haven't been talking a lot because I'm paying attention more to the video that I'm playing in the background. You probably can't hear it. If you can, I'm sorry. It's really loud. For my mom. My mom always says your video is too loud. But that doesn't really matter right now. You have to do it, parents. Oh my god. I'm so lucky you guys can't hear everything in the background. Or I hope you can't. Because some of those things would be pretty embarrassing. But anyways, I think we're most likely just gonna end the video here because uh, I am i don't really want to continue it. But anyways, uh, that's gonna be it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed me just rambling about random stuff. Anyways, I hope you guys have a nice day slash night. And also, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. Goodbye. Goodbye.